Good morning guys, welcome to the shop. Um, I got big changes I thought I'd record and uh, put on the channel uh, for my records and for you guys to see. Um, Wednesday night is a uh, beer drinking night with the pilot crowd and uh, somebody sent out the text about three o'clock like everybody, somebody always does. And I said, well, what about coming over here and helping me move airplane parts and then we can go out. And so that's what we did. Had the wings in here, you probably remember if you've been watching. And I moved those out to the other garage and moved the this is the forward section of the fuselage, moved it in here to start working on that. The wings are pretty much done. I got a few little things to do yet, and uh, but all that can wait till we are about ready to paint and mount them on the, the airframe. So uh, this is the quick build fuselage. This is just the forward section. That's how it comes. You still do the tail cone, the aft section, which attaches back there. I'll walk around here and show you. This is... Uh, that beam across there is the back of the seats or, or the seat support. So that's the rear seats, so you can see the right one over there. And then so back here is the baggage compartment. Down here you can see where the baggage door will actually be. That's how it comes. I haven't done much. I've taken some stuff apart, uh, but I haven't done much to it. So if you're interested in seeing what the quick build fuselage looks like, this is it. Uh, pretty much the way it came off the truck, I had uh, Partain deliver it which was uh, that worked out good I would highly recommend that um, I'll show you the roller caster mounts that I've got it setting on and the height seems pretty good it could maybe be just a touch higher but those are just some cheap furniture dollies from Menards and then I built those little risers maybe you can see how that one's kind of an I-beam or an H shape out of 2 by 6 or 2 by 8 I forget what it is and then some foam and that way I can roll it around pretty good in here and not worry too much about it. I want to keep track that it doesn't start shifting around on the foam and, and trying to come off. But that's real handy for me that uh, to be able to move stuff because I kind of cramped in here. And I'm keeping the mower in here with the blade on it for the snow. Uh, once we're done with that, that'll give me a lot more room. But I've uh, been taking out the uh, today. I'm working on pulling out seat pans and the side side panel that one's still in that's the way it came a couple of screws in there holding it on but you take that apart to get in there of course um i had to make the two center covers that's uh, this cover here and, and up front that was laying upside down there but uh that's it i thought i'd just uh, record this uh kind of helps me to to know when i did stuff uh, this is like the 13th of january 2019 so it's been a little more than a year, um, and I ordered quick build wings and fuselage. I was going to build the wings, and then I realized that the, the tanks were done, and I've built tanks before, so I thought, you know, what the heck, I'm not going to spend my time building tanks and gooping up with uh, Pro Seal. It's not terrible, but it's just like, okay, yeah, I've been there and done that. So but that's it. That's what the quick build fuselage looks like after somebody starts tearing stuff apart of it. See you next time.